Heather, thank you for sending us your tip. You got a good stride, but there's definitely some things you have to work on. One of the first things I see when I'm seeing your stride is that what we would call your outside edge stride, which means your inside edge, which is your power edge, you're not using it enough. So when you actually stop the tape right here, you can see, even though it's a little bit blurry because we've had to blow it up through YouTube, even though you can see, see how your recovery leg is going to come in and it's going to drive on the outside of your foot and that means it's going to take you that way and then this recovery leg as the left leg comes back you're once again going to be predominantly on the outside of your leg. Unfortunately that, what that does is when you're skating you're only getting a real push at the end of your stride not the entire way through. So what we're going to have to do is widen your base a little bit and then now as you're pushing out you're actually getting a C more of a C inside edge, outside edge and then push and that will actually make your stride a lot smoother, a lot longer, and powerful from start to finish. So as I just mentioned, now when you actually look at the tape, watch how you're ending up on the outside edge and not utilizing your inside edge to get a powerful push the entire way through. So you're, just at, you're getting that good push right at the end, but we need to get it a lot stronger at the start. From the, side, from the side view, we are pretty good. You're getting the, the knee in relation to your toes very good. You're, see, you're actually seeing your leg is actually getting right at the end. Right? As I was saying, you're getting a pretty good full push there. Your upper body is in a pretty good athletic stance. So from the side view, it's pretty good. We'd still like to see you drive your butt down and use your buttocks more on your skating right now help use your inside edge. So getting that a little bit lower will be key for you. But all in all, from the side view, it does look pretty good. The last thing I want to highlight is your stopping is actually pretty good. You're seeing you're getting good shoulder width apart, your feet angles are pretty good, but your upper body is getting a little bit twisted. And what that's going to do is you should be maybe more uh, up, upright and together, twisted the other way. That means you'll be under control when you fully stop, you'll be ready to push off again. But the biggest thing I would say, suggest for you is try to get away from that outside edge skating. And what you're seeing is you're almost like a rower when you're skating. You're pushing, you're pushing, you're pushing. Instead of being fluent all the way through, nice, powerful, long stride and smooth, that's what we're going to work on with you, Heather. Thank you for sending your tape. Keep getting better every day. iHockeyTrainer.com.